Oh, Bubba, here you go. Maybe. Uh, hello, everybody. Hey, guys, we're going. Bubba, say hello. Bubba and I here. Do another mission today, another adventure. Maybe. 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 Say hello. She's a bit shy around cameras, don't she? You like your face being on camera, do you? Hey. Anyway, here we are. Bubba, say hello. Get that out of my face, there, she's saying. Anyway, so welcome to another video, another adventure. Today we're at our oyster spot. I felt hungry for some oysters, so today we are here at my spot. It's got to go over this hill here, and we get to the last little bay here where we've got some lovely oysters. And uh, we don't need too many, just enough for a bit of a taste test. So I'm just going to grab some oysters. Then you're going to go around to the harbour over here. Then we're going to go over there and wash them and have a feed of oysters. And also a special treat for you guys today. I took a bag of white bait out of the freezer. We're going to have some white bait fritters and fresh oysters. Now, how does that sound to you guys? Does that sound like it's going to be tasty? <laughs> hey, you guys want some? Oh, what the heck? So, do you guys think that's going to be tasty? I think it will be. Also bought a lemon, we're going to squeeze some lemon juice over the fritters and over the oysters. And that, my friends, is going to be our lunch today. Rubber, you like oysters, Rubber? No, she doesn't like oysters. She likes cockles, though. Another day where I'm by myself, no one around. There's COVID everywhere around here at the moment. And I don't want to be around anybody else, as you guys know. So, here by ourselves, in the fresh air, away from people. We're going to do a gather for you guys today, so stick around and I hope you enjoy this video. Bye-bye. Nice. So we just come into a little bay here. This is our little spot. Or one of our oyster spots. And I tell you, that mud is pretty bloody thick today. It's pretty hard going in these steel cap boots. But we just got to head around the corner a bit. Really warm day today, but we're getting some really cool nights, so we know that summer is nearly over. Abba, we have to. Should we go this way and then we'll, we'll cut across that river? Much easier. We should try a bit further up here, rubber. And hey, hello. You're right. Which way should we go? What I think it's under this mangrove here. Oh, I can see one sticking up right there already. Let's try this. See if we can grab some under here. There's one. Look. Here's a nice one, I think. Two. Couple there. There's a nice one. Look, oh, one little area, which is awesome. Another one there. Those here. You can see one out here sticking out. That one little area, we've got some nice little teal oysters there. Pretty awesome, eh? One little spot, I managed to get those ones, about probably seven. Oh, well, I was in the mud over there. Well, we'll go and look for another mangrove and we'll see what we can see under. Another mangrove. I think there's one here. Not, not big ones, but they're okay. This one looks alright. Okay. 
Yes, I can taste them already. Oh, it stuck. Right, let's try another mangrove over here. Rubber, right? Right? Yeah, bro, here, yeah, Podu is. <laughs> hey, you having a good day? It's a good day, isn't it? Now, I can see one over there sticking out, looks like a, a keeper. Another one here too, I think. Ta-da, nice. Another one over here. One off, oh, yeah. and that's a nice oyster. Look, nice and cool, too. See, that's pretty good. It's a nice shaped oyster. That one, it's just sitting on top of the mangrove. Well, we're doing pretty well. Look, not bad for a bit of a scratch around, is it? One even notes, even the Check that one out. Hiding there in the mud. Another one here too. Nice, good one. There you go, how's that for our little gather for today? That one there was just sitting on top of the mud. How right about that one? Right, look at you as you get so putty, bro. Yeah, and I think that might be it. I think we've got enough for a taste test. Right there. Oh, what's that? Another one right there. And, and that's it. We got heaps. We got heaps for a taste test. Here we go. Right. Time to go around to the harbour now and we can clean these up and start doing some cooking. Because I'm getting hungry. There she is. Papa, alright. She's hot, she needs to swim. Well, I'm gonna put you in the car. You two padu, look at you. Papa. Is it is the mud deep there? Can I cross it all right? In my steel caps? Can I? Should we give it a go? Hello. All right, it's pretty muddy here. As you would imagine, it gets quite deep. It's really muddy. 
But if I act like a ballerina, uh-oh, I'm stuck. Stuck, but I made it. Thanks for your help. Whoa, whoa, it went up quite deep. Woohoo, just made it in there. Crazy stuff being a gatherer. More adventures. Crazy stuff. Look at that. Right, so here we are at the harbour. It's a beautiful day here. There's a bit of wind coming across this way here, which might make it a little bit difficult to for our gas burner to cook our kai on, our fritters on. You guys will know this place here. I've been here before a few times cooking up kai here and fishing. So we're going to have our kai here. Last time I was here, I cooked up, what was it? Sausages, I think, on my little wood stove. So I've got my rod here. I'm going to throw a bait out on a little ledger rig. With some squid on. We're going to have a little fish here. It's probably about two hours, maybe an hour into uh, before low tide. So we're going to give it a go. It's pretty calm. Somewhere, I think. No, I'll be right here. It sounds quite hard. Boy. Oh, it sinks a bit long, but. Do that'll do nicely right there. Right, so our rods in, and now we're going to clean our oysters up. It's actually quite cool here in the shade. A couple of boats going in and out. There's a little boat just going out now. I'll show you guys in a minute. I'll show you guys when he goes past. Definitely is a one person boat. Holy hell, it's not even that, half a person boat.
Oysters in there. Coming down. There's some nice oysters. Not a bad size. There's some four over there. Looks like, oh, it's a nice one. Look, that one might be into a taste test. This one. This will be a taste test one. Probably that one there. Maybe that one. And that one. A nice little cooking spot, I hope. I'm gonna cook up over here. We'll set our stove up here. I've got my little cast iron stove and a gas bottle, the old APG gas stove. So we're gonna set it up here and that should be out of the wind, which feels quite good. So, in the sun as well, so you guys can see a bit more what's going on. And it's a bit warmer in the sun than in the shade. See a bit of breeze, but that should be a good little spot right down here. I love this little system, it's awesome. Nice and portable. Make sure you unclip this first. Just keep an eye on my rod. Little eagle rays in here. So the cast iron pan sits really well on here. Holds it down. There we go. Actually good there out of the wind. It's pretty good. So here is my white bait. 200 grams, we need to put them into a container. Got a couple of eggs here. Also got some prawns, I'm gonna need some prawns. Put some prawns, mix up in it. And I'll use some for bait as well. I'll throw some prawns there on our, on our line here. Prawns and white bait. I'm on it. And of we've got our famous butter, we need our butter. So, I need to mix it up in here, I think. Mix up in our butter container. I didn't bring another container, so I have to use this one here. I love butter, so... Seasoning in there, and we'll cut some prawns up in there as well. Salt, pepper. Took some prawns in. So 
something different. Some prawns into our white bait fritter. We'll save some for some bait. Be enough. Yeah, that's enough. And two dots of bait. Yep, sweet as. Tasty cry cooking away there. You want some white bait fritter? Eh? Yeah, bro. The old famous blue plate on top of there. It just fits perfectly there. Bit. So nearly ready. Give another couple more minutes and we'll just turn the gas stove off and we'll let that cook through with the famous blue plate on top. There you go, she's ready. She is ready, I'm going to turn it off. We'll go and shell our oysters and we'll come back and we'll plate up our delicious koi. So I'm just going to shell some oysters now to have with our delicious white bait fritter. Here we go. Delicious oyster. Just open up a few there. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, and 14. It's a bit of a small one, this one, but it doesn't matter. It's going to taste nice. So, all we need now is to plate up our, our white bait and prawn fritter, and then time for our taste test. But there we have it. There's our some shelled oysters there for you. All ready to eat. So should we go in the sun and eat them? I think it's a good idea. Let's go. The oysters. Just don't want to get sand on them ever. Yeah. There we go my friends, there is our oysters ready. Check out those oysters, beautifully gathered today. We're going to eat those for you right now, all of them for this taste test. A bit of lemon juice, and we'll get our fritter out, which is in here. Can I get this out? Oh, there it is. Check that out. Ooh. White bait fritter. Go away, fly. And oysters. Here we are, down here in the harbour. Doesn't get much better than that, does it? Right, let's play it up, shall we? Now, I didn't record that going into my 
I couldn't recall that going into my plate, my famous blue plate, but there it is, it's in my famous blue plate. And there you have it, see? Oh yeah. Check that out my friends. Check that out with that lovely prawn there. Mmm. Mmm. Right. Make sure we need these. Let's try these. Must be one of the best taste tests I've had all year. Mmm. Yum. Check that out. Not big oysters, but they are very, very sweet. And they're free. Mmm. Man. I survived this taste test. Wow, there was something about oysters, the flavour that it has. Mmm. No bro. Any fish on my rod yet? Nearly gone. Oh. Not many left now, my friends. Mm. Whoa. Best kai ever. The tide's coming in, rubber. Might have a fish for. Might have a fish after we uh, have our feast. Mm. Three more to go. Last one, lucky last. Will I eat this? And the answer to that question was yes. Right, time for our fritter. And I'll say it makes you some as well. Delicious white bait. Oh yeah. Let's try some of that prawn. We've seen a prawn and white bait before, like that. Mmm, I'll save you some. Let's go away. Yep, so I'm gonna hurry up eat my kite so I can have a couple more cars. Right, so there we have it. There's our delicious white bait fritter. Mmm. Wow. Mmm. That lemon juice on there is bloody delicious on that white bait. Mmm, wow. You guys want some of this? Right. Grab it here. Yeah. You broke. Is it gone already? No, oh, I mean, you eat too fast, brother. I'll eat too fast, brother. Yeah. There you go. See how she eats out of that? Right, a little bit more for you. And that's it. Okay. Rubbers, rubbers white paper. Yeah, my honey. Hey. Nice save. Eh? Yeah, no more. A little bit of prawn. There you go. Right. So there you go. There is our delicious little feast down the harbour. 
I'm going to finish eating this and then uh, we'll chuck some more bait out. I've got some pilchards here as well, which I'm going to want some. Oh, yeah. I've got some pilchards here as well, which I'm going to like, use. And I'll use the rest of that squid. Okay. Tide's coming in. So, what am I getting? A couple of javelias would be nice. Be some javelia around now. Yeah. Eat it up. Sure. Got there's a fire over there. Relax by the water and uh, try and fish some of the incoming tide. So I'll be here for the next couple of hours, just relaxing after we had a delicious lunch. Rubber, come here, girl. Come over here. Come over here. Yeah, Rubber's having a having a great time sitting here relaxing. It's so nice after that delicious feed we just had. What better way to Relax after that feed and, and sit here and have a bit of a fish. I've had no bites all day. This is my second lot of bait I've put out now. Uh, using the half a pilchard on the ledger rig. And I've got no takers yet. So I don't normally fish here, as I said before, during the day. I'd rather fish here, change the light. Going into night time is way more productive than catching fish during the day but as far as like filming for YouTube goes doing a cooking show today anyway not fishing show but fishing if I catch a fish Rubba come here girl and get a stick Rubba's having a great time she's enjoying the the serenity of the harbour it's so nice here So hopefully we might get a fish this afternoon. I've got a couple of hours to spare before I go home and uh, got things to do. So next couple of hours I'll spend down here and we'll see how we get on incoming tide. So you never know. You might get a trevally. Rubber. You can get a stick, rubber. Use a stick. Hey. But, It is a beautiful day. It is such a nice day. I'm just sitting here watching that fire over there on the hill. I think it might be contained, that fire. Looks like it's contained. Haven't seen much flame. There's a house uh, next to it on the right there. The one behind it. Yeah, so we're hoping for maybe a Trevally would be nice. Or Kahawai, maybe a snapper, and we might get an eagle ray as well. Who knows? Rubber, ready? Hey, she loves this. She loves coming down here anywhere where there's water to have a swim. Our rubber, our best mate, rubber.
Yeah, it is nice. It's nice here, especially after summer. All the tourists have gone. It's just nice and relaxing now. So yeah, it's nice. Nice day for it. Beautiful day for it, Rapper. <sighs> so what do you guys think of this place? We're pretty lucky, aren't we, living here? Pretty lucky. Yes, yeah, so I'm just going to have a fish for a little bit. There also. Just try and fish some of this incoming tide and see what happens. Might get lucky. But yeah. After that delicious feed, I'm pretty content for the day. Anyway, rubber all right, let's just stick. You gotta fill your holes in before you go. Hey. We're gonna have a tired dog this afternoon. Tonight, yay. Hey, we just stick. We'll stay for just a little bit longer. One more cast, one more cast, and no, then I'll go home. One more cast, rubber. So I put down one rod too, because I was just going to be made to cook our, cook our food. So it's quite relaxing one rod, but two rods is always better. There's not much current in here today. You know, I'm getting hot out here in the sun filming this. So I'll get back to you guys soon. Hey! So you go, got a couple of prawns on there now. So we'll cast that out. Right, there you are, I'm pretty much all packed up. Can you see me there? The sun's right there, it's quite annoying. Anyway, I've had no luck on that prawn. Is that better? Yeah, that's better. That's better. So I've had no luck on that, oh, that light. Right, there you go, that's better. So I've had no no luck whatsoever on that prawn. Still on my hooks, but I've got to go. It's nearly four o'clock. Still got another two hours incoming tide. Two or three hours. And it would be really awesome to stay. It's, it's a really good afternoon. Check that out, man. It's a beautiful afternoon here, but I've got to go and cook tea. Cook tea for another video tonight, so... You guys will probably see that video before this one, maybe. But I've got to go home and cook that meal for that night. So that one's going to be tasty as they stick around. I hope you guys enjoy watching these videos. And if you could subscribe and like these videos, leave a comment. I read all the comments. But yeah, it's a beautiful night to stay. It'll be so nice here. I haven't got much bait. Enough for, enough for a little while. That prawn, I think. I think I'll bring some more prawn down next time. Next time I go fishing, I'm gonna have some prawns. I would much rather fish here at Change of Light. The videos that I've caught fishing here have always been at Change of Light and at night. We're just going on into dusk. Just going on before Change of Light in the afternoon. And the tide is pretty good. It's pretty good tides. Not so much current, which is great. So anyway, uh, Hope you guys enjoyed this video. It's a pretty awesome day. Awesome day. Prawns and white bait and oysters. So thanks for watching and we'll catch you guys on the next video. We'll take it easy. Bye.